making this evening. And she's also responsible for the 10 pounds that everybody gained over the summer. <laughs> He does. In the package, um, we have a lot of school supplies. Um, Randy told us because they are growing up, and, and everybody, every grown person needs to have. Um, <laughs> Thank you. 
lifting at the end of her junior year versus her senior year. So I think wow. that's important. Yeah. <laughs> Roberto Rivera. Roberto is Eddie's brother. I did not know that. He graduated from the School of the Arts and will be coming to NCC to study music. Roberto Rivera. That is a smart kid. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's her. <laughs> and um, Diamond saw that about Morgan State while she was on the cottage tour. So nice. Um, John Lightfoot. Oh, wow. <laughs> and while Ryan is standing here, we are offering our first Resiliency Award to Ryan. Um, Ryan is the recipient of the Resiliency Award. Um, because he was expecting everything that was in that box. <laughs> he, he questioned me and quizzed me yesterday, and I was dying. Um, are we going to get a book? I was looking for, I was looking forward to um, the places you go. Did you buy that this year? And I said, like, no, I didn't buy it this year. My goodness. Um, but we are, we are honoring Ryan with the Resiliency Award because when Ryan came to the program, he was recommended by his counselor because she thought that we could give him the support that he needs. As you can see, Ryan is standing here with his uncle and aunt because his, both his parents passed 
um, before he even started high school. And, and they have been his parents um, and, and has been very generous to allow the Upper Brown program to help them to, to parent Ryan. We have had long conversations um, on both ends uh, as to how we can direct him and, and help him to, to move towards the future. And he's doing it. So we are very proud and I, hope, and I know that you guys are extremely proud of him also. Um, but the other reason why we are honoring Ryan with the Resiliency Award is because he took it upon himself to bring students who didn't know anything about the Upper Bound program. And he would bring them, he wouldn't make any commitment. He said, Miss, you need to talk to him. <laughs> but, you know, I don't want to tell him anything. So because of that, we have um, at least three of our graduating seniors who are in the program because Ryan insisted that they participate. In fact, and they have been participants because he made sure that they get there, they, they would get there, they would all come down as a team. Um, but he saw the benefit of the program for himself. And in, in a situation where a lot of times people, was, you know, other students would say, oh no, I don't think I want my friends to go to the he wanted his friends at the program with him and, and really worked hard. Uh, so we are very proud of you. Okay. This is from member, yeah. Um from Captain Gar. Yes, we just love it.
wondering about what he missed, but he was sure to be good at it. So, um... <laughs> He's going to be leaving us, but we're very sad. I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm not believing it, but he says that he's going back to California, so we've done all the applications and he's all set to do so. But MCC is wide open, right this morning? So um, we're looking forward to that. So Marche has something to say, so he will be coming up. Marche!
class, um, senior graduating students, remember you have a home, but you will be reminded of that. Um, to community support, because I, I forgot to recognize Mr. Gibbons, uh, because not only does Durham be, uh, um, start as a web student, a human service person, um, he mentored the students, but now he has his own not-for-profit organization that's doing stuff for the community, and um, in fact, was one of the contributors to, to the Residency Award for Ryan. So, um, want to acknowledge that because he stayed very dedicated to the program. Ms. Robinson, who has dedicated her garden, and we go and we do volunteer work there every summer. Um, just truly appreciate your support because she's here every year supporting us. And um, and every other year she, she contributes to a scholarship also for the program. So we truly appreciate everyone who's been here, staff, um, have a safe journey home and you have a wonderful summer. Thank you.